my gosh, it has been a while and I'm so sorry. As you can tell, I'm not good at the vlog thing. When you last saw me, I got COVID from Nashville. So that was all June wrapped up. July after that, I was just kind of taking it easy, um, spending time with friends. Uh, we did a bar crawl through Houston, which was a lot of fun. Uh, lots of exciting stuff to come. So hoping to kick this off with just kind of a day in the life again. Um, I am going to be up in Michigan twice coming up. So that's going to be really fun. Come along. You are now an Astros lady. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I think Coda has definitely missed being part of the vlog content, right? Good girl. Alright, that waffle, super good. I have been keeping up with the boxing, and that is exactly what we're gonna go do right now. I'm still gonna take the elevator downstairs because I'm about to work out. Don't judge me. Coda is headed to the sitter because I am headed to Michigan today, so I'm already flying spirit, so packed everything into a backpack. <laughs> Are you excited? Yeah. Okay, y'all, my flight is delayed by an hour and a half, so we came here, we got a margarita, and we're chilling. Hope it doesn't get canceled. All right, despite landing at two in the morning, we've made it to lovely Michigan. Weather is perfect, 70 degrees, way better than Houston. Okay, y'all, mission accomplished, baked goods acquired. Michigan trip went fast, but it's officially done. We are headed back to lovely Houston uh, with a layover. A seven hour layover in Orlando to be exact because Spirit had no other options. We're gonna make it happen. It was worth it, but not enjoyable. Especially for someone who does not like flying. I hate flying. On the bright side, the silver lining is um, my family lives in Orlando, so I get to see them even if it's at 10 p.m. for just a couple of hours. Yes, we have connecting flights with these people going to San Juan and Houston later. We are on the opposite side of the airport, so when you come out of here, you're getting baggage, it's going to be easy, and then Rob... Oh my god. Anyway, we tried to land, and... Yeah, it's lightning and everywhere. It was super bumpy. They tried to make an attempt, but the car got crosswinds and bumps, and they couldn't. And so he pulls up, circle around, says we're going to try from the east, literally what he was like putting the lock. We tried to get a ton of the east, across once again. I thought we were going to like push through, and then we pulled up and we diverted to Fort which is like a three hour drive from the window by the way. We land there, so we refuel, and we sit there on the plane for another hour. And then 
then they tell us we can fly back. So we fly back because it's also kind of bumpy. Yeah. Yeah. And now never doing this again. So apparently the jet bridge is not working. That's cool. Apparently we're not close enough. It's just pretty laughable at this point. get this y'all it wasn't that we were parked wrong a different guy came and tried to do the jet break and we finally got off it's 12 10 no it's 1 10 whoa new wheels i made it fortunately but it was so late, I couldn't really spend time talking with my family. But yeah, just trying to get like two hours of rest now um, before I get on my next flight. <laughs> that's, an, that's frustrating, but what can you do? So exhausted, I just feel horrible. Yeah, I'm at the airport again. They're out of espresso, so they can't make basically any coffee except just straight black coffee. I did not get a drink, but I got a croissant because I haven't eaten. It's going great. I landed, I made it to the parking area, and I now have to go to work, so I've changed my outfit for those of you who noticed. Um, in the car, so it's gonna be a busy day. Overall, I mean, the trip was obviously worth it. The silver lining of the layover was that it was at my home. <laughs> Overall, just not a great flight experience this weekend, but I'm glad I'm here. Now just a day of work, gonna get Coda in the evening, and yeah, we did it. It's exhausting, but we did it. Okay, I made it back home. This is how dedicated I am backpacks all my things hello my baby hello you're so cute hello mm. Mm. hi <laughs> she's been here 30 seconds she already spit water all over my floor i missed you <laughs> Aww. Several days later. So we are at my favorite place, Trader Joe's, um, to get some frozen foods to stock up on for the next couple weeks. And uh, these last forever because they're frozen. So that's nice. <laughs> this Trader Joe's used to be a movie theater, which is kind of cool. Whew. Now we're done. And now it is time for chicken sausage and broccoli pasta in progress. Three, two, one. Mm. Looks amazing. Mm. Mm. 